हेलो फ्रेंड्स वेलकम बैक होप आप सब अच्छे होंगे होप यू आर डूइंग वेल सो दोस्तों आज हम लेकर आए हैं बी एस एन एल जी लाइज दो के लिए प्रैक्टिस कर रहे हैं हम कंप्यूटर आर्किटेक्चर का पोर्शन लाए हैं ठीक है तो जिसका दोस्तों सलेबस दिया हुआ है हमें जो ये लिखा हुआ है सलेबस आप देख सकते हैं ठीक है दोस्तों तो इसके अंदर हमारा है कंप्यूटर आर्किटेक्चर बेसिक कंप्यूटर ऑर्गेनाइजेशन डिज़ाइन प्रोग्रामिंग सी पी यू आई ऑर्गेनाइजेशन एंड मेमोरी ऑर्गेनाइजेशन कंट्रोल यूनिट डिज़ाइन फेमिलराइजेशन विद डॉस विंडो कॉन्सेप्ट ऑफ फाइल डायरेक्ट्री फोल्डर नंबर सिस्टम प्रोग्रामिंग एलिमेंट्स ऑफ हाई लेवल प्रोग्रामिंग लैंग्वेज पासकल यूज ऑफ बेसिक डेटा स्ट्रक्चर वेब पेज डिजाइन स्क्रिप्ट लैंग्वेज परल सी जी आई जावा स्क्रिप्ट फंडामेंटल ऑफ जावा प्रोग्रामिंग एडवांस फीचर ऑफ जावा प्रोग्रामिंग तो हम ये पूरा सिलेबस कई स्लाइड्स में कवर करेंगे कर, कई पार्ट्स में कवर करेंगे तो लेट्स सी टूडे वॉट वी विल टेक सो वी विल गो टू नेक्स्ट सो इन कंप्यूटर इंजीनियरिंग कंप्यूटर आर्किटेक्चर इज अ सेट ऑफ रूल्स important what is it it is set of rules and methods that describe the functionality organization and implementation of computer system the architecture of system refers to its structure in terms of separately specified component that system and their inter relationship to ek simple sa humne samjha ki computer architecture hai kya to aaiye ab dekhte hain उसका मॉडल तो दोस्तों ये एक मॉडल दिया हुआ है एक ब्लॉक डायग्राम हमारा दिया हुआ है कंप्यूटर आर्किटेक्चर का इट इज अ ब्लॉक डायग्राम ऑफ बेसिक कंप्यूटर विद यूनी प्रोसेसर मीन्स इट वी आर कंसिस्ट वी आर एज्यूमिंग इट हैज ओनली वन प्रोसेसर द ब्लैक लाइंस इंडिकेट डेटा फ्लो वेयर एज रेड लाइन्स इंडिकेट कंट्रोल फ्लो एरो इंडिकेट द डायरेक्शन ऑफ फ्लो फ्रॉम वेहर टू वेहर इट इज डेटा इज गोइंग सो वॉट वी वॉट सी पी यू हैव सी पी यू हैव कंट्रोल यूनिट दैट इज कंट्रोलिंग द इंस्ट्रक्शन दिस इज दिस पार्ट इज इज कॉल्ड प्रोसेसर और दिस इज अ एल यू पार्ट दैट हैव कॉम्बिनेशनल लॉजिक एंड रजिस्टर्स दैट इज इम्पोर्टेंट प्रोसेसर इन बिल्ड हैव रजिस्टर्स मीन सम मेमोरी एलिमेंट इस वेरी स्मॉल मेमोरी एलिमेंट दैट इज रिक्वायर्ड फॉर प्रोसेसर एंड कॉम्बिनेशन लॉजिक दैट इज दैट डिकोड्स द अर्थमेटिक एंड लॉजिकल ऑपरेशन एंड अदर्स सो दिस इज द बेसिकली मेड ऑफ वेरियस गेट्स एंड दैट सी पी यू इंटरेक्ट विद मेन मेमोरी ओके एंड वी हैव सम इनपुट डिवाइस एंड आउटपुट डिवाइस दैट इज कनेक्टेड विद सी पी यू the actual mathematical operation for each instruction is performed by combination logic circuit within the cpu's processor known as arithmetic logical unit to dosto ek question humse full form mein pucha ja sakta hai what he can ask full form of full form of alu okay guys so what is the full form of alu it is arith matic logic unit in general the cpu execu- executes an instruction by fetching it from from memory using its alu to perform an operation and then storing the result into the memory so so from where instruction is fetching from main memory and from and and where the data is storing it is in memory so from main memory instruction is going to processor and the data the output is going again stores in main memory after processing through the processor that is the simplest thing now 
I think you got some idea, roughly idea, what what computer architecture is. So now we will go to some question, some quiz on that. So we will sharpen our knowledge. Let's see first question. Who developed the basic structure of computer? So options are these four. I am giving you ten seconds to solve. Just guess, then I will tell answer. Hope you guessed your answers. Answer is C. John von Neumann. In nineteen forty-five, von Neumann proposed his computer architecture de- computer architecture design, and later it was known as von Neumann's architecture. It consists of control unit, ALU. register and input output so what we saw in this slide it was von neumann architecture okay so it is it is von neumann von neumann architecture okay dost okay friends so it is given by john von neumann so we saw we will see next question which of the following allows simultaneous write and read op- uh, read operations and options options are this these are options i am giving you 10 seconds please just guess or try to solve it okay friend answer is c ram now what is uh, one question can be made what is RAM, what is full form of a ram so please guys note it ram is random access memory so it can also ask what is erom what is rom read only read only memory so these will form can also can can be asked in in our exam so it is important we have to know that and what is erom if e e comes then it is erasable erasable rom means erasable read only memory okay friends hope you got it it is a hardware device generally located on motherboard of a com- of a computer and act as a internal memory of the cpu it is read and write memory of a computer which means the information can be written to it as well as read from it okay okay guys got it what we are saying okay next question which of the following is not considered as a peripheral device so guys what is peripheral device peripheral device are devices which are connected with cpu okay so guess your answer or try to solve it i will give you 10 seconds answer is cpu CPU is not considered as a peripheral device it is a primary component of the computer as we saw in our uh, computer architecture a computer system cannot work without CPU peripheral devices are not the essential part of the computer it can be defined as a auxiliary device that connects to the works with computer such as mouse keyboard so these are the peripheral device so answer is sip here so th- so friends we will make quickly the answers of all so you can uh, refer easily see and here we have john von neumann okay so 
so now we will go to fourth question which of the following computer memory is fastest among these so i am giving you 10 seconds please solve it then i will tell answer so friends answer is register why register because register is in is a part of processor register memory is the smallest and fastest memory in a computer it is not part of the main memory it is located in the cpu in the form of register which are the smallest data holding element so if if we see our part register is part of a processor so it is a fastest one okay friends so it is a fastest one so answer we marked is register next question we will see which of the following memory of the computer is used to speed up the computer processing i am giving you 10 second please solve it friends answer is cache memory cache memory is a high speed memory which is small in size but faster than the main memory means ram so what is our main memory if 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 someone ask main memory main memory memory is ram okay the cpu can access it more quickly than the primary memory means cache memory can be accessed faster or quickly than ram so it is used to synchronize with the high speed cpu and to improve its performance okay next question a computer address bus is options are these please solve i am giving you 10 seconds friends answer is c unidirectional address bus carries the address of data but not but not the data it is carrying address and not actual data between the processor and the memory address bus is a 16 bit which can address up to 64 kb address bus is a unidirectional okay friends next question which of the following circuit is used to store one bit of data options are these please solve it friends answer is flip flop flip flop is a digital memory circuit and with the help of the flip flop we can store one bit of information the fundamental block of very sequential circuit is flip flop next question the address in the memory is known as answer is physical address because actually actual mem it is address of actual memory physical address space in a in a system can be defined as the size of the main memory it is really important to compare the process size with the physical address space the process size must be less than the physical address space so what we know the process the process size must be less than physical address space okay friends next question subtraction subtraction sorry subtraction in computer is carried out by like what we are saying a minus b subtraction is carried out by in which form answer is two's complement 
Two's complement is used for representati- representing signed numbers and performing arithmetic operations such as sub- subtraction, addition. Next question. Which of the following system bus connects the CPU to the memory on the system board? So options are these. Please solve it. So answer is system bus. So friend, system bus is a single bus that connects the major component of the computer system. So friend, these are the question what what brings we brings for you and i hope you enjoy you learn something so what we learn what is computer architecture what is the building block of that and we solve some question okay friends so 1 to 10 we solve 10 questions hope you learn something and we will bring more parts of this uh, computer architecture also for your learning purpose and for quiz and we are selecting question like that 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 has a probability that can come in lies or similar type of question that can come in lies and we are try we, we are trying to pick pick those questions for you and uh, hope you uh, you start uh, preparing for your internal exam that is lies for j to jto and if you are not started yet please start so time because time will run very fast and so we will try to give you maximum videos that will helpful in your exam and thank you very much and i am also preparing for that thank you very much